1977 Citroen 2CV van in grey. A very, very pretty little thing, this one. First registered in the UK in 2012. If you check the website out, James, I'll detail all that on there, where it came from, if we can find out, and things like that. Uh, but like I say, it's all UK registered. It has been since 2012. Left-hand drive as well. 602cc. Very, very pretty little van, this one. Body weight wise we're going to start off at the bonnet, work our way around onto the interior and then we'll go for a nice cold engine start up. It's been here a couple of days and it starts on the button, this really does. Up the bonnet, lovely and straight across the, across the body lines there. It is a little bit flat on the bonnet, it might want a bit of a polish in places but I do quite like it like that. Across the front scuttle there, we've got a little bit just starting underneath here, just a little bit there but not bad at all. Across the vents all good as well. Nice and tidy around the screen and onto the cab there all nice and straight and tidy up there again the odd little mark here and there but it does want to polish a little bit flat on this roof there nice and straight as we come down the bonnet to the grill no problems no dings or dents in that lovely and straight there headlights are nice and clear on both sides see that there nice and clear a little bit of bubbling in the paint here on the right hand side onto the front wing nice and tight like i say it does want to polish in places so it's a little bit flat in the paint but it's all all adds to the character of this one lovely and straight no corrosion coming through there in the lower half bumpers are in good order right hand side wing is lovely and tidy as well around the wing itself we've got no rust coming through it all flows nicely there's no dings or dents in the body lines there you can see how nice and straight that is so you've got your original little stickers there telling you all the bits you need to know the lovely and tidy inside that air panel tiny little bit of corrosion just starting here on the edge of the bonnet and on the edge of the uh, wing there on the right hand side matching painted wheels all the way around with sort of knobbly tires which looks really really cool nice and straight across the lower sill section up the door you can see it's all nice and shiny there's no dings or dents it all closes right lovely wing mirror there glass is nice and clear as well tiny bit of bubbling just around your window latch there it's a little bit there but again once the window's down that's not noticeable at all it's ready for the shows this one a few little chips in the door itself but again nice and tidy very very presentable as we come down the van side of things lovely and straight down the bottom half on the body moldings there no dings or dents not had a hard life this one no nasty marks around the fuel for the cap really nice and tidy down the back there matching wheel again but lovely and straight i've not seen one in this condition for a long time as we come up to the panel side of the van, lovely and straight once again. You can see it's got some sign writing on there. And that is only, uh, they are just vinyl stickers. They're not, it's not painted on. So that will come off quite easily. Lovely matching roof rack as well. Even the roof's in lovely condition. No major dings or dents at all to the to the tin work. Lovely and fresh down that left hand, uh, right hand side there. Sorry, get me left and right mixed up today. As we come round the back, Light lenses are crystal clear on both sides. The rear doors themselves are lovely and tidy. The whole, whole thing's so presentable, so usable. Nice and tidy across the top half section. Down the right hand side door, lovely and fresh down there. No big dings or dents at all down both rear doors, in all fairness. Lovely and fresh. Got a little bit of bubbling just starting to come through here on the left hand side below the hinge. Right hand side, a few tiny little bits in the paint here and there a little bit of bubbling on the bottom of the corner but apart from that very very tidy as we come around the left hand side again the van side of things lovely and fresh no problems at all with that the roof's really nice from the left hand side as well lovely and straight down there let's see i haven't seen one like this straight for quite a while lovely and tidy across the lower half sections we've got a few bits of there's been a sticker on there i think and a little touch in here but again, you've got to have your nose against it to notice any of that. Nice wheels on this side as well, all, all colour coded. You could do with a little bit of a refurb on the wheels. They've been really, really hot. Got a little bit of surface just starting on the steel. But lovely and fresh as we come down the left hand side, which is the driver's door. Again, no dings or dents, no rust coming through on the lower half sections of the door on the edges. Lovely and tidy around the handle. A few little marks around the window clasp there, but that's to be expected. And again, glass is lovely and clear on the left hand side. So come on the front wing once again no rust coming through anywhere on the front wing that i can see on the on the on the, on the back edge there all nice and tidy got a tiny tiny little bit down the bottom corner off a few stone chips sits lovely and level this one as well ready for the, ready for the shows great business advertisement as well because we've got so much 
space to uh, sign right and they're very very quirky door cards in lovely condition on the left on the right hand side no rips or tears at all the seats are lovely with this very thin seat cover on there really comfy as well they don't look too comfy but they certainly are lovely rubber mat fitted out throughout the front there with no nasty marks on it you can see all the floor in there it's lovely and tidy as well if i lift that up you can see that there dashboard no problems at all with that we've got a little 12 volt power outlet there but apart from that lovely and fresh on the dash all the doors close right as well not have to slam anything on this one into the rear again lovely old vintage trunk in there going with the rest of the style i will lift this up so you can have a look at the floor in the back like i say it's not had a hard life this, life this one at all there's a few little marks in there a bit of paint flake here and there where stuff's been used against the edge but apart from that no problems at all in there go around onto the left hand side front which is the driver's side again everything opens right and closes right no problems at all with the door card no rips or tears anywhere on the door card and again seats lovely condition a little bit of wear to the side of the seat there but it's really honestly it doesn't look like it should be comfy but it's incredibly comfy that seat no problems at all in there nice and clear on the dials nice steel wheel protector all the way around as well onto the engine bay now like i say it's a 602 or three sorry cc engine this one lovely and presentable in the engine bay as well mechanically it's on the button this really really is james has jumped in there he's going to fire it in life we'll have a little bit of choke because it is cold start up but it doesn't need much this one no problems at all with that there it's hitting over nice and happy there it's very very quiet for 2 cv this one it's a good little noise that little chugging away there There you have it, the 2CV, that's a 2CV 400, I believe, but I'll call it a van. The 2CV van there in grey, charming, charming little vehicle, this one, ready to be enjoyed, ready for some air, ready to be put to work as it was, this one.